Good morning and here we go with the weather forecast. Now some of this is not great, I'll be honest with you, but where we're going is a much better spot. More typical fall weather is on the way. But let's go ahead and get through today because there's some big changes that you need to be aware of. First of all, uh, we're going to have some hazy skies with some smoke. You know, the fire out in wine country is certainly still burning and will likely grow today, adding more smoke to the area. And that's uh, if you're downwind, uh, that means you're going to be looking at some smoke later on today. Uh, we're going to be looking at highs near 100 degrees and the winds are coming up, but not quite strong enough for a red flag warning. So not the best scenario, but not the worst. Here's some of the smoky skies uh, seen near New Thomas, John took that photo. There's a plane coming into SMF just yesterday evening. Remember, you can uh, download the ABC 10 app and then upload those photos right there in the weather section at the bottom of one of those tabs there. Now, air quality in general is a little bit more downgraded than yesterday. I say a little bit because many of these are exactly the same, which is unhealthy for sensitive people in the SAC metro area. We're adding in San Joaquin and Stanislaus County uh, as well for today. A lot of this is a combination of heat as well as some smoke and haze uh, in the area from some of the recent fires. 60s and some 70s early this morning for either the foothills or the valley floor and some 30s up high. So we're certainly starting to see those fall weather changes in the Sierra cold in the morning and nice in the afternoon. And the wind is starting to pick up for Fairfield, Stockton, Modesto, San Francisco, but still fairly calm elsewhere. This is going to change in the Gilmore backyard and other valley locations. We're going to see after the sun comes up just past seven o'clock this morning, the wind start to ramp up as well. We're going to hang on to the 80s until about noon or so. Then we cross over into the 90s and from 1 p.m. till basically sunset, we're going to be in the 90s getting very close to 100 degrees and also, as you can see, very close to the records, which are all just a little bit above 100 into the afternoon. Uh, the smoky skies are really apparent once you get closer to where the glass fire is and the San Joaquin Valley, lower foothills all the way down to Bakersfield. But the wind is going to shift things around a little bit. Mostly the winds you'll notice are out of the northwest. That is a dry warming wind, uh, but uh, it's not that strong. It'll be breezy and stronger than yesterday. You'll notice it, but not red flag territory. That's when you have very dry air and gusts upwards of 40 miles an hour. We just don't see that today, although it will be hot and it will be windy into the afternoon, not just for the valley, but region wide as well. We're going to hang on to this late season heat for Thursday for Friday as well. I like the timing of the cooling going into the weekend and then next week a couple different things happen. We're going to hang out in the 80s all week long. The high is only 80 on Thursday and even though I'm showing mostly sunny with just some clouds there in the mountains, we may be looking at some light rain. Brittany.